Do people make money with acorns? That's the question we're diving into today. You've probably seen the ads, heard the buzz, maybe even have the app on your phone. But does it actually work? Can you really turn spare change into serious cash? Let's find out. First things first, what is Acorns? It's an investment app that rounds up your purchases to the nearest dollar and invests the difference. So, that $3.25 coffee becomes a $4 investment. It's a painless way to start saving. But does it actually make you money? The short answer is, it can. The long answer, well, that's a bit more complicated. Let's talk about how Acorns makes money. They primarily generate revenue through management fees. This means a percentage of your invested funds goes to them. While this isn't ideal, it's a common practice in the investment world. Now, let's talk returns. Acorns offers different investment portfolios based on your risk tolerance. Historically, the stock market has shown growth over the long term. So, if you're in it for the long haul, you stand a good chance of seeing your money grow. But remember, past performance is not indicative of future results. Investing always carries risk. You could lose money. This is why it's crucial to understand your financial goals and risk tolerance before diving in. Acorns also offers additional features like found money, where you get cash back on purchases. This can boost your earnings, but it's not guaranteed. So, can you make money with Acorns? Absolutely. But it's not a get-rich-quick scheme. It's a long-term strategy. The key is consistency. Small, regular investments can add up over time. Let's talk about some real-life examples. There are plenty of people who swear by acorns. They've turned hundreds into thousands over the years. However, there are also those who haven't seen significant returns. It's essential to set realistic expectations. Acorns is a tool, not a magic wand. It can help you grow your money, but it won't do the work for you. So, is Acorns worth it? That depends on your financial situation and goals. If you're looking for a hands-off way to start investing with small amounts, Acorns could be a good option. But it's not the only one. There are other investment apps out there with different fee structures, investment options, and features. It's worth shopping around to find what works best for you. And remember, diversification is key. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. Consider spreading your investments across different asset classes to manage risk. Finally, let's talk about alternatives. If you're looking for a more hands-on approach, you might consider investing in individual stocks or ETFs. You'll have more control, but it requires more time and knowledge. Another option is to open a traditional savings account. While returns might be lower, your money is safer. Ultimately, the best investment strategy for you depends on your individual circumstances. Do your research, consider your options, and make informed decisions. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.